Hello and welcome back to Silent Hill 2. Through the power of walking through the town, we've arrived at Neely's Bar, which I didn't do before. At uh, this lovely camera angle, which I completely ignored before, to meet somebody. Well, supposedly, anyway. Camera, please. Uh, okay, well, creepy text. What's that say? If you really want to see Mary, you should just die. But you might be heading to a different place than Mary, James. Yikes. Somewhat threatening. Also, again, really personal. I guess somebody knows you, James. What have you been up to? There was a hole here. It's gone now. Oh, so that's where this comes from. I've seen that on, like, on the internet like loads of times. Okay, I was kind of curious. So, there's nobody here, but we've been left with, like, threatening letters. Isn't that nice? So, gonna have to mosey through town again. I've used the power of editing to cut the majority of this out. But that notice is interesting. I mean... What have you been up to, James? I mean, obviously Mary's dead, so I'm guessing that's what that indicates, but... What have you been- Hey, Legs! What have you been up to that's gonna, uh, send you to the wrong place, James? Anyway, editing powers, ho! Through the magical power of editing, I bring you back to where we were, more or less. So, we're heading out to the Silent Hill Historical Society now, and, uh... I, I don't know. I, I, I have no idea. So, we're going that way. That, that's the plan. I wonder if we're going to see any more of these guys get blinged over the edge, because that was uh, pretty weird. Oh, uh, I, hi, Nursie. One thing I did pick up along the way was another health drink that I found. Oh, and some bullets, by the way, which I must have missed on my way through last time. Not terribly exciting and not worth keeping on the, uh, on the recording. Right. Uh, just, just keep heading on this way, isn't it? It's not too far up the road. I should have also, by the way, I didn't mention, uh, I kept the recording information in the corner last time by accident, I don't have it this time. So again, if you suddenly see the recording suddenly get cut, it's because I'm checking to make sure it actually recorded. I don't want to do too much and realise it didn't work, because I can't see if it's actually working or not. It makes me spooked. So, uh, any time is a good time to check that. Hello, nurses! Very unsettling, but I'm not here for you today. I'm here to go to a museum. I hope, anyway. No one's getting flinged over the edge this time, but the nurses are everywhere, so, you know, bogus. Weirdly, you can actually see way further in the dark than you can in the fog, which is kind of cool. There's a nurse here. Here we go. In theory. I use the old bronze key. Oh, cool. You'll see my second save file here. Ta-da! That was to make sure I didn't crash when I tapped out. Right. I need a map. The lock is broken. Of course it is. This place is dark, yo. There's nothing useful written on them. There's nothing particularly special about this photograph. The photo is hanging there. Okay. Guy looks weird. Looks kind of like James. A photo of the director of the old Brookhaven Hospital. It looks like he was a famous person in town. It's a photo of a hole. There is a photo of a deep hole. A deep, deep hole? What could this be? Ugh! Okay. Somewhat spooky. I'm gonna have a look around the rest of the building first, just... in case. Whoa! Hold up! What the hell is that? Wish I could have a better look at it. Oh, there we go. Misty Day remains of the judgment. It's him. Look at that. Isn't that a disturbing image, just generally? Like, the boxes with the hanging people. Who actually look very similar to the boss I kind of had to shoot, don't they? The one with the lips. Because they had, like, a thing around them like that. There's a painting missing. Oops. Alan Smith, date of birth and death unknown. A scene from this era from long ago, from the style it looks like it was done sometime around 1820. There were a few, a lot fewer people then and only a handful of buildings. Okay, but the painting's missing. Maybe someone nicked it. I guess we're descending though. Q. Descending into hell analogies here, I guess. I really like the one from last time about going down, down, down. 
into the depths of the earth to lose Maria only to get, you know, to get to rise up again without her. Though this is a suspiciously deep hole. Uh This is a very long way down. That noise as well. Does this never end? Do I need to turn around? Oh no. A very black hole door. The hell? Creepy. Some kind of document is lying here. It's December 11th, 1820, prisoner number C221. It's a prison. I can't read the rest. What is this? Well, it's a prison, James. Come on, keep up. Got a first aid kit. Anything else? I don't need to shoot this guy, although I've got like a million shots. Why not at this point? What a creepy place. Actually, I better reload before I do anything. It's broken. I have no map of this place either, so I can't compulsively check the map to see where I am. What the hell? Look at these paintings! It's just weird. A painting's hanging here. Crimson and white banquet for the gods. Look at this! Look at them dressed up like that. It's weird culty shit. Death by skewering. Oops. An execution at the prison. Death by skewering or strangling. To choose his death is the prisoner's last taste of freedom. Toluca Prison Camp. Built during the Civil War, later became Toluca Prison. James is looking at something. Handgun bullets. Anything else, James? Nope. Here's the hole in the painting. The hole's dark and I can't see anything. Will you jump down? Yeah, sure, why not? No, seriously, James, don't do that. That's ridiculous. James, if this was Heather, she'd be like, I ain't jumping down there. You can't see the bottom, dude. At least test it first. Oh, nice, we dead. Wait, what? Oh, it's water. It's a reflection. Okay. And it's just a wall. Oh. It would be impossible to climb this. It's just a wall. Okay. Oh, can I smack it? That's a shotgun. Try again. Stick. Mm, well, it's worth a go, I guess. Maybe iron stick? Nope. There's some rubble on this bit. Maybe this bit? Maybe I've got the wrong idea. There's no bits of this that I can climb, I guess. There's no bits that seem obviously damaged or I can do anything with. Well, jumping down here is a bad idea. Come on, there's gonna be something I can do. No. 
I'm guessing geometry breakage wasn't a thing back then. But I can't see any cracks or anything, and I can't see, and there's no way to climb. I'm just gonna have to check every bit of wall, aren't I? Oh, here we go. Just this spot feels different than the normal wall. I wonder if I could somehow break it. Oh, a seamlessly smooth transition that was. Well, whatever. What the hell? That's a really creepy noise. Cool. Still no map though. Uh, reload. Oh, two doors. I got the spiral writing key. It's locked. Really? Really? Okay, good. Can I turn my torch back on? Is this thing out of batteries? It won't light up when I press on. Do I turn it off and on again? Okay. What about that key I just picked up? Key with a slim, three inch long cylinder attached. The cylinder is engaged with spiral writing. Examine. It says, Tis doubt which leadeth thee to purgatory. Oh, thank you, cryptic key of assholeness. I don't have anything I can make a match out of either. Just checking all the walls, I guess. That's the keypad, right? Gotta have something I can do. Rifle shell, shotgun shell, shotgun, hanger, butt, handgun. Healing items. Dry cell battery. Can I do anything with this? It looks like the same type of battery as the flashlight. Oh. Maybe I gotta... Ugh! Oh, gross. <laughs> Can I, just, can I just get out of here now? It's locked. Oh. Okay, well, can I just leave? Uh, this is super nasty, and I hate it, and it buzzes. So these ones are lit up, so let's just try the combinations. So many. I'm assuming I'm getting this right, of course. Aha! Ew. Well, that sucked. Uh, how much health did I lose? I don't know. Probably none. I'm in green health now. That's probably good. There's a door at the bottom. The door is locked. I mean, I just got a key, right? Wait, I just noticed there's doors on the s ceiling and wall. Okay. Okay, that's broken. Oh, that buzzing noise is absolutely horrible. Silent Hill knows all my terrible fears. Ladders. Buzzing things. This layout looks like the area from above, but, you know, bars. Okay, maybe I've got to use that key, which says the key to purgatory, on the hatch on the bottom of the floor. Maybe, I don't know. That's a big butt you have there. Let's try it. Down again. It's pitch back beyond the door. I can't tell how far the blackness stretches. Will you go down? Ugh. But that's a normal corridor. If I jump, do I suddenly just stand up right? Nope. The 
hell am I now? Still in like a prisoner area, I guess. Killing a person ain't no big deal. Just put the gun to their head. Pow. You, you killed him? But, but, but it wasn't my fault. He, he made me do it. Calm down, Eddie. Tell me what happened. That guy, he, he had it coming. I didn't do anything. He just came after me. Besides, he was making fun of me with his eyes, like that other one. Just for that, you killed him? What do you mean, just for that? Eddie, you can't just kill someone because of the way they looked at you. Oh yeah? Why not? Till now, I always let people walk all over me. Just like that stupid dog. He had it coming too. Eddie? <laughs> I was just joking, James. He was dead when I got here, honest. Anyway, I gotta run. You're going out there alone? Yeah. Eddie? I don't even know what to say about all that. Damn, Eddie is like completely unhinged. It's a corpse. The body is marked with bullet holes. Gee, I wonder why. So Eddie probably killed the person in the apartment, like we guessed, and is now killing other things. A dog included, I guess? Got some health drinks around here. Anything else? Got the tablet of the gluttonous pig. Interesting, there's a portrait of the room. Doesn't look quite so crappy in here, though. Alright, let's save this then. Just overwrite this one.